You just didn't know how to handle those emotions in the past in the correct way. So you hid from them and now you're feeling them and recognizing those emotions that normal unaddicted people feel all the time. Welcome back to Jay's Way. Please hit like and subscribe and comment below. I thought we could have a discussion about why when you are in recovery, it can sometimes feel more hurtful and you know things can get really challenging more so than even when you were in your addiction. So why does it sometimes feel harder when you're doing the right things? This is completely related to the fact that addiction is hiding. When you act out in your addiction, you are trying to feel differently than you're supposed to. You don't want to feel sad, so you get high. You don't want to feel, you know, whatever negative emotion you're feeling. So you get drunk, you watch pornography, you gamble, you you seek after that chemical feeling that helps you to escape from reality and gives you a positive emotion. That's what an addiction is. And when we go into recovery, we are no longer hiding from those feelings. When we're sad, we have to learn how to do our work and go from sad to happy or how to accept the fact that we are allowed to just feel sad and that's okay. So sometimes dealing with those negative emotions that we used to hide from with our addictive behavior can be very daunting and it can feel like things are really difficult and hard. But the truth of the matter is you just didn't know how to handle those emotions in the past in the correct way. So you hid from them and now you're feeling them. Also, and this is very, very important, there are consequences to your negative addictive behaviors. There are consequences to the past mistakes you've made. And when you go through the addiction recovery process, you overcome those past problems. You deal with those consequences, again, that you've likely been hiding from, okay? So sometimes those consequences are, are very difficult. However, going through that process where you learn how to control your emotions in the correct way and you overcome all of that past drama in your life, it's completely freeing. Once, once you get through that, and you get to that point where you now know how to handle your emotions and you don't have any more past issues that have to come up and attack you, you are free from all of that. And now you're in a good, happy place. That's where the recovered addict is going to come to you and, and, and tell you that there is hope. OK, when you get there and you just don't have all that weight on your shoulders, you don't have fears pulling you down. You don't have resentments that keep you back. You don't have past issues coming up all the time and haunting you. And you don't have that inability to handle your emotions and feelings. That's freedom. And that's what addiction recovery is. So, yes, it can be hard to go through that initial process and to handle all those things. But the end that's true joy. Peace, love, and joy. That's the Savior's way. That's what happens with addiction recovery, and that is Jay's way.